Good morning everyone. We already know about permanent tissues which are derived from the meristematic tissues once they lose the ability to divide. Also that broadly the permanent tissues in plants are of two types. Simple permanent tissues and complex permanent tissues. Simple permanent tissues are made of one type of cells which look like each other. So what exactly are complex permanent tissues? Let us see. Now there are other permanent tissues which are made of different types of cells. They together perform a specific task hence they are counted under one tissue. These are called complex permanent tissues. So remember complex permanent tissues are made of more than one type of cells and these cells coordinate to perform a specific task. Xylem and phloem are the examples of such complex tissues. We already know xylem carries water and minerals absorbed by the roots upward to different parts of the plants, specifically the leaves. And phloem transports the food produced during photosynthesis from the leaves to the different parts of the plants. So phloem carries both in upward and downward direction. Both of these tissues that is xylem and phloem are conducting tissues and constitute a vascular bundle. Now coming to the structure of cells, xylem is made of four kinds of cells. These are tracheids, vessels, xylem parenchyma and xylem fiber. These cells have thick walls. Tracheids, vessels and xylem fibers consist of dead cells. Only xylem parenchyma cells are living cells. The xylem parenchyma stores food and helps in sideways conduction of water. Tracheids and vessels are tubular structures. This allows them to transport water and minerals vertically. Remember, a vessel is also known as trachea. The plural of trachea is tracheae. Xylem fibers are mainly supportive in function. And what about phloem? Phloem is also made up of four types of cells. Sieve tubes, companion cells, phloem fibers and phloem parenchyma. Sieve tubes are tubular structures with perforated walls. Amongst these, only phloem fibers is made of dead cells. The rest that is sieve tube cells, companion cells and phloem parenchyma are living cells. So now you know broadly the permanent tissues in the plants are of two types simple permanent tissue and complex permanent tissue. The simple permanent tissues are made of only one type of cells which look like each other whereas complex permanent tissues are made of more than one type of cells. These cells coordinate with each other to perform a common function. The simple permanent tissues are of three types parenchyma, cholenchyma and sclerenchyma. The complex permanent tissue consists of xylem and phloem and these consist of different types of cells. Hence they are called complex permanent tissues. Xylem consists of four different types of cells. These are tracheids, vessels that is trachea, xylem parenchyma and xylem fibers. Of these only xylem parenchyma consists of living cells. Phloem which is another type of complex permanent tissue also has four types of cells. Sieve tubes, companion cells, phloem fibers and phloem parenchyma. All of these are living cells except for phloem fibers. So that was all about tissues in the plants. In the next class we shall study about the animal tissues. Till then bye bye.